Um, and I thought they did a really good job of just keeping their cool and going out there and, and staying focused when they could have get gotten very flustered and just finished, um, you know, throwing the game in and went to, you know, game two was dangerous and it was dangerous by losing that one because it kind of woke them up um, and opened that door of opportunity. So winning game three was crucial for us, almost more important than game four because it just pulled that momentum back to our side, um, brought the energy, brought them back to life, and that, that confidence went up. And so uh, game three was was a crucial point. Tell our servers that, like, you know, you don't want to leave the game on an error. You, you want to leave the game on something that that team deserves and, and that they've earned it. Um, you know, so you, you want to be on that service line as long as possible. It, it doesn't have to be aces, but pulling them out of their offense, making just trouble on the other side, making it easier for us to receive a free ball. That's that's the, the goal of the server. Um, and that's where in games two, you know, when we were ahead and they got the rhythm back on their side, we couldn't get back into our rhythm. Um, <clears throat> so in game three and four, um, it was kind of, especially in game four, it was like a mirror image. I was like, oh gosh, you know, 17-11. We were up 17-11. Um, and almost lost it. So what they did well in game four was they, they learned from their mistakes um, and cutting it too close in game three, and they finished the game uh, with solid play in game three. Nice for us is, you know, about a quarter of the way through the season, we kept mixing it up, kept mixing it up, and we found something that worked, and we stuck to it, and they bought into that process, um, and they just kept, you know, focusing day in and day out and trusting the process, and eventually they're getting the product. Thank <laughs> you.